Hi, I'm Nicole Mariano from 11 Mendel and I'm here to talk about applications of circle. So again, what is a circle? Circle. A circle is a set of locals on the plane equidistant to a center. Pizza delivery area can be represented by a circle and extends to the points 0, 18 and negative 6, 8. Write an equation for the circle that models this delivery area. So, the solution formulas for this problem is the distance formula and the midpoint formula. To find the midpoint, we will use a formula x of 1 plus x of 2 over 2 comma y of 1 plus y of 2 over 2. So this is, let's just replace. And our midpoint, negative 3 comma 13. To find the radius of a circle, we use the formula, the square root of x x of 2 minus x of 1 squared plus y of 2 minus y of 1 squared. Again, we'll just replace it. We'll just use, we'll just pick any of these two, 0, 18 or negative 6, 8. Of course, we will choose the easiest, which is 0, 18. So this... The square root of 34. We found our radius. We have our midpoint, we have our radius. The last thing to do is replace. Okay. So it's x plus 3 squared x plus 3 squared plus y minus 13 because it's positive squared equals the radius is 34 34 so our final answer is x plus 3 squared plus y minus 13 squared equals 34 we're not yet finished because we have to plot so let's proceed to problem number two a person is remodeling the front entrance to his home and needs to cut an arc for the top of an entranceway. The arc needs to be 32 feet wide and 8 feet high. So, locate the center of the circle and find the radius so the person can use to draw the arc. Is 16, comma, 0 negative 16 comma 0 because it's 32 so 16 plus 16 is 32 32 feet wide and 8 feet high this would be 0 comma 8 so we're finding the center of the circle it's not at 0 0 so let's just pick any of point in here let's say here so is the radius this part and this side should be the same we know that this part is 8 feet but this is we don't know yet so let's say let's write x this it's the representation of the radius. This side is 16 feet. If you look closely, this is a right triangle. The thing that I remember about right triangle is the Pythagorean theorem. That a squared, b squared is equals to c squared. a squared plus b squared is c squared. So this is A, this is B, and this is C. Let's find B. A is 16 squared plus B squared 
equals 8 plus x. So that's our c. 8 plus x squared. 16. x is equals to 12. There you go. We found the missing part. So x is now 12. So this is C, E. And we'll just go back in here, which is 8 plus x. 8 plus x, replace x with 12. 8 plus 12 is 20. So 20 is our radius. So, our center is at 0, comma, negative 12. Our last problem is, Rosie built a semicircular patio next to the kitchen of her home. The patio spanned the distance of 12 feet adjacent to his house. Write an equation of the circle that models the patio shape. So, let's say that this is her house, this line here, and the patio is the curve line here, or the semicircle. Semicircle. It says here that the distance of the patio spanned 12 feet, so this whole circle right here is 12 feet. Again, the standard equation of a circle is x squared plus y squared equals r squared. The distance is 12 feet. But it says here that it's semicircular, so we'll divide it with 2. R is 6. 6 squared. R is 36. So there, we already found R. We already found the equation. X squared plus Y squared is equals to 36.